To give you an idea of what Salesforce is, we talked to a developer who told us how he became a Salesforce developer and how he uses it every day. I'm David Liu. I'm a Salesforce developer at Google and I dream in Salesforce. I graduated school with a marketing degree. Um, didn't know how to write a single line of code, but marketing always works with sales and that's how I got started with Salesforce. And just due to you know, circumstances on the job, I dabbled a little in code and, and I fell in love. It was, it was love at first sight. Um, and, and from there, you know, I just went all the way forward with it. And um, you know, I told myself, wow, I love this so much. You know, in, in, in 20 years time, if I looked back at my life and, and I didn't know how to code, then you know, I'd be really disappointed in myself. So, so I picked up Salesforce coding and, and yeah, now I'm doing what I love. Salesforce, it's really like a, like a playground. You can build anything you want with it. Like I've seen people build apps for recruiting. Um, I've seen people build video games on Salesforce. You can build websites. Um, it's really up to your imagination what Salesforce is. There's a lot of things you don't have to worry about when you're coding in Salesforce. When you're coding in other languages, there's these things called boilerplate code. Just code that you have to write that, that's meaningless, that's totally unreadable, that you have to write just so that your code works. In Salesforce, every line of code you write is, is directly relevant to your app. It's all business logic. So there's two ways you can build things in Salesforce. You can do the point and click way, or you can code. And, and most of the time, you're actually doing a little bit of both. I started with point and click. Um, started not knowing anything about coding whatsoever. The skills that you learn when you're doing point and click, it, it's absolutely super important for coding. Um, you cannot be a good Salesforce developer without knowing the point and click stuff really well. Um, the reason for that is there's so much you can do with point and click. Um, if you can do it without code, you always want to do it without code. One really cool thing about Salesforce is how quickly you can become good on the platform, how quickly you can become a good developer. From not knowing how to code a single line, in six months time, you can probably learn enough to get a job as a Salesforce developer. I love Salesforce, yes.